hello everyone welcome to my channel and in this video we are going to create a custom dialog box like this so let's start i'll create a new feature in android i'll select empty activity then here we can write the custom dialog custom dialog and we are going to create in quotely so click on finish So project has been seen. So first of all, what we go, uh, we'll go to XML part, and here, uh, with this, uh, we'll make it a button. Okay. Then for button, we are going to create one ID. Btn. R dot ID dot BTN button okay then BTN dot set on click listener here uh, first of all we are going to create one XML right click here new then layout resource folder my custom underscore dialog and here we are going to make one card better we can do it in linear layout that's also fine linear layout then orientation should be vertical and <coughs> here we are going to create one card view match parent and you can give okay. inside we can create all those things okay so first we are going to create one linear layout uh, this should be match wrap. orientation should be vertical okay and here we are going to create one text gravity center text style bold okay uh, we are going to print this only first so under this we are going to create dialog how to open the dialog so we are going to write well dialog binding is equal to here we are going to write layout layout inflator dot inflate inflate then we are going to give the id of the layout r dot layout dot my custom dialog comma null okay then here where my dialog is equal to 
डायलॉग डायलॉग गिविंग कॉन्टेक्स्ट देन वी आर गोइंग टू सेटिंग दी डायलॉग माय डायलॉग डॉट सेट कंटेंट व्यू डायलॉग बाइंडिंग सो दिस बाइंडिंग वे आर सेटिंग हियर अगेन यू कैन गिव व्हाट एवर प्रॉपर्टी यू नीड यू कैन गिव फॉर दिस सो लाइक यू कैन एड डायलॉग डॉट सेट कैन सेवर ट्रू और फॉल्स true or false and then you can give the window the get window window dot set background background dor okay then here we can pass the color color inside color dot transparent okay so now we can show the alert dialog dialog dot so here null pointer exception okay now if you want you can use the uh, buttons first we are going to run this program then we can okay here i don't have this 31st so i need to make it 30 let me run it again we are going to see whether we are able to see the dialogue or not okay here some so app is getting run oh uh, we should wait for a few minutes so yeah it's done so now i have to click on hello world so uh, we have to see whether we are going to get this uh, light dialog or not so let me click oh it's very small right what is coming okay no issue we can make the changes in layouts hello guys so i have again i have made changes on layout so what i have done it i have created this was the previously we have created the linear layout then inside card views so in card views i have given the padding 10 then background white and corner uh, radius 14 this will be the this corner radius okay then again i have created the uh, linear layout that is a vertical and the text title so here i have given help text okay then inside i have created relative layout in the relative layout we having the message okay and again i had created one view as not visual then <coughs> here i have created one more linear layout inside i have created one button so this ok button even you can create one more button beside to this uh, button as for the your requirement even you can create here one cancel button so by clicking on the cancel you can dismiss the pop-up so shall we run it again okay we are going to run again
and so you can see the pop-up okay so here we can click okay so uh, for clicking the okay we have not written the code so we are going to write that code so first of all what we can do we can create the id for that okay so below to this i am going to create well s b t n is equal to dialog binding dot find v y i d this is the text view sorry this is the button button r dot id dot alert yes yes then yes button dot set on click listener here what we can write um dialog dot dismiss or whatever you can uh, uh, whatever you want you can write the code here suppose you wanted to do some activity you can do with this code so let me check this is the right button id yeah this is right so shall we run it again and we can check okay perfect so the text is getting hidden here so here what we can do this we can make it match then you can see so everything is perfect guys you can do this coding for the custom dev this is the main code for the custom alert dialog thanks for watching this tutorial thank you